Hey sweet angels, it's your girl Karina and of course, you know, it's a thrifting day. Super elated that, you know, the weather's changing, the hour is changing, and your girl wants more sweaters. I feel like now a lot of the thrift stores have their sweaters out and I just want to go thrifting. I've also have spent the like the last couple days like on Pinterest and just getting inspo and wanting to get ready. I recently got sick with like food po poisoning and all that so I just been in bed and now I'm just like I want to go out. I want to get ready. I want to just like get dressed and so it also has inspired me to like want to go thrifting and find things on my thrift wish list. Yeah that's basically what we're going to be doing. We're going to be thrifting of course my fall wish list and all these amazing like fall things that I'm so into. Let's just go and see what the thrift gods have for us today. Let's go thrifting, baby. Woo! I'm checking the skirts first. It's first skirt I just found. Another white too, maxi. But yeah, I wanted to check the maxi skirts first. It'd be so ideal to find like a plaid one. Look at this black one. Look at the symmetric hem. This one's kind of fun. I like the pattern. This one's so good, yo. Oh my god, I know some of us have been looking for plaid. This one might be too long, but you just never know. So now let's just go to the lingerie because we're close and you know we can always find amazing slips. With red being such a big thing this season, like I'm obsessed because I love pops of red with any neutral outfit. Um, and I see a pop a red. Look at this mesh up. Just so there's 30% off instead of 20, which I'm happy about. I've been seeing burgundy tights everywhere. Okay, hopefully they fit me though. Look at these teal ones. Instead of going to dresses, I'm gonna go to the jackets. Because your girl really wants to look at all the jackets. This scarf right here though. It's giving Burberry. So we're gonna add it. Okay, we're in the sweaters. Anything neutral or red, honestly. Or you know what? I feel like it's gonna be the next color. Navy. Navy for sure. Well, I want like zip up sweaters too. Like this one's nice and it's express. Girl is on fire. Something like that is so fun. Jones New York Sports. I like the stripes. I like the zippers on this. Okay. I'm just like inspired right now that I'm just grabbing everything. This is what I've been looking for. A black party like this. Oh my god. Y'all like, can you stop me right now? I can't. I sweat. And of course, it's Old Navy. Old Navy always does us good for stuff for y'all because I've asked you what's your thrift wish list so if I see stuff I'm also grabbing it for y'all you know it's not just for your girl it's also for y'all just hint hint look at this red one it's like a red turtleneck with the balloon sleeves it's already filled and I've only been here like 10 minutes talk about sequins I don't like Phoenix, but I feel like this backwards, like with the skirt, put it in the clip. See, this is the kind of sweaters I'm looking at. Like it's beautiful. It's like a bell sleeve. It has a zip. There's more sweaters over here. Gosh, look at this cardigan right here. 100 wool for a dollar and ninety. I like the print of this. You should see my cart right now. It's really full. I like the color on this long cardigan. I like that. That's cute. Quickly show you my cart. Look, that's the cart situation already. But we're here in skirts, so I'll check those out. Oh, 
I want like that Miu Miu style mini skirts. Last time I found some good shoes here, so I'm gonna keep an eye out here. And I'm checking the blouses because I always sleep on blouses. Pictures like a hit. I feel like they've been coming in style a lot, so I'm just gonna put them in. Please tell me they're my size. They're an actual 10. These pumps stop. I'm gonna try them on. They're neutralizer too, so you know they're gonna be comfy. They fit. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I found some Mary James. Stop. It says they're a size 30. I think a 39 might be too small for me. <gasps> they're so cute. Stop. These black velvet ones. They also have some blue ones. Hey. What size are these ones? Also 39. I think I'm just going to get the black ones. I wish they were my size. I used to have something like this. 2018. I'm gonna go through here through this jacket aisle. The jackets here sometimes tend to be more expensive lately. So look like look at this London fog trench. If it's not on sale, I don't get it. I think it's like a good price. I've been looking for a red one like this, more fitted. Ooh, girl. What do you think about this one? This one's cute, but I don't know. I really like this one. I left it last time. It's for 20 bucks. You won't believe the knee height boots I just found and Look, they're my size. The ultimate fall boot right here. I ended up attacking just the dresses by myself. I didn't find much. Holland section has gotten smaller. They're replacing it with more Christmas stuff. But like I said, last time I was here, I found two amazing Halloween cardigans. Like really good ones. So hopefully... One pops up. So, oh, these are cute though. Okay, that's cute. Let's go to the like new tag section. But yeah, this stuff is a little bit more pricey because they're new tags. But usually, find some good stuff. Y'all, I think I saw this girl who found like these fry boots or like duped fry boots. They looked good. Is that sequin stress? Literally sequin. I love the high neck on this and it's kind of glittery. What brand is it? Oh, Banana Republic. I'm like, they're selling it for 20 bucks, but it's good material. Mm -hmm. I am so full. I had yogurt for breakfast with some banana. And since I've been like recovering from my um, sickness not too long ago, like I get full. Also, I'm curious, how do y'all feel about the little mic things? Because I feel like right here would be perfect to have a little mic because it's so loud. Uh, but I don't know. Let me know how you feel about that. I'm thinking of probably getting one. Like an external little mic to be talking to you like this. It's the end and I don't know if I can get through the stuff so there might not be a portion where I show you what I found because it's a lot y'all. <laughs> I'll see if I can show you quickly as possible. There's like so much stuff like I'm kind of overwhelmed but let's see. We have this top so cute. This London sweater really nice this velvet dress 
I might leave this one, but I love the like the Chanel vibe that this gives. This like gingham dress. I know it's very spring, but I can also picture this in the fall with like a trench coat. So these jackets, like I found this one. It's like suede. This one, which I think it's fun. I don't know. I feel like one of you would like this one, so I'm like debating. Like I pinned a red one in this style. Found that. I think this one's cool because you can make it into a vest. This top, I think it's fun. I think I showed you these earlier. This little party. <clears throat> this guest mini. Midi. Midi skirts when you high boots, so boring. But I just quickly want to add because don't sleep on the accessories. On my Pinterest, I have this girl. She's wearing like a midi with like these long leg warmers. Look. And then like anything colorful socks. These are like silver. So those are good. I found those. This reversible bucket hat. I love the plaid. Very fall. And you can do it this way too. Mary Jane's. I found these yellow. I found velvet. These Skechers. I have to go and like source by the the returns. But yeah, y'all, it's gonna be good. I cannot wait to show you. It's like I feel like this is like one of the biggest thrift hauls I've had in a long time. But I'm so excited. So let's get going. Just a little FYI, everything I'm bringing home. It was good. Okay, it's time to go home. Yeah, massive thrift haul coming soon. <laughs> hey friends, so I'm not gonna spend too much time into... No, I have one of the biggest hauls that I've done in a while. Like, let me show you. I came home with a freaking trash bag of clothes and I still had a separate bag. It was a successful thrifting trip. Y'all, I went in there telling you this morning that I was manifesting sweaters and jackets and <laughs> I feel like I got all of that. On top of that, it was a 30% off sale. Usually it's on Tuesdays. Clothing is always on sale, but it's just like a 20% off, which to be honest, I don't mind because it's like 20% off every price tag. On top of that, most items are like a dollar. And this week they're doing a 50% off sale. So starting on Thursday, October 12th, but by the time I post this, it already happened. So it won't happen this following week, but the la the week after. So I'll put it down below, but look, I didn't even know that, but apparently they also had a sale on Monday. I'm currently getting bit by a freaking mosquito right now. And so I'm gonna put some off. Anyways, y'all, it's gonna be a long haul and I'm so excited to show you the things I thrifted. So that's why my haul is also massive because it's not just for me, it's also for something in the future. I'm gonna show you everything and then I'll indicate what is mine. So anyways, I think I'm gonna just start off with the first thing up here, which is one of the items that I'm not personally gonna keep, but like I kept looking at this item and I was like, I cannot leave it. And it is this freaking jacket right here. First of all, I love the silhouette of this. I love that it's kind of moto style jacket, but it has like this faux like shirleen on top and then on the sleeves as well as on the bottom. I've been really inspired specifically on TikTok. I've been getting these like photos instead of videos. It's like photos of people posting their outfits and a lot of them are in Paris or like Copenhagen and they're wearing like similar jackets like this with like a maxi plaid skirt. Yo, which is the only thing I feel like I haven't been able to find at the thrift, so hopefully I might have to check like online and see if I can find it, but uh, so cute. It's by this brand called A Cripple Creek. Okay, so this next piece, I'm debating on keeping it or not because I really love this, especially because this is just such a good piece and it is this maxi crocheted skirt. I have a white tiered skirt, but the one that I have Honestly, it was too big on me. I have to belt it. I feel like this one would actually fit better. So that's why I'm thinking of keeping it. And the cool thing is too, I feel like these type of skirts are just so versatile. Perfect in the summer, spring, and in the fall. So 
I just cannot leave this one behind. I'm thinking I'm gonna keep this one. One, and it is by this brand called Lifestyle Batiste. 95% cotton, 2% spandex. So just a really nice like maxi skirt. And of course, let me tell you the price. This one was a dollar and 91 cents. On top of that, everything, like I said, is 30% off. So when I say the prices, there's like additional 30% off on top of that. So this next skirt, I really hope it fits y'all because I am so elated about it. It's truly so different. And I have been one of those people that I've been trying to find a maxi skirt and it's been so difficult. I found a couple, but they didn't fit me. So I hope this one truly fits. Really different, it is this ruffled maxi skirt. Like, look at the opening in the front. It like literally opens kind of like, I don't know what you would call that, like a huge slit in the front. And then it has these ruffles and then the ruffles go to the back. Like, how cool is that? It's fun, I've always wanted like those maxis that were, had like the big slits in the front, but just couldn't find one. Usually they have them like in the back or on the side. But I found this one and it's just so different. And I can just imagine this with even like the sweater that I'm wearing and some knee high boots sneaking through this. Like what the heck? And so difficult to find denim maxi skirts. So the fact that I found this one right here, I'm just like over the moon. And I love pieces like this because they're like basics, obviously, but they are made in a different way. The wet is completely different than just like a regular long denim maxi skirt. Love having pieces like that and then pairing it with something very neutral is by this brand called INC if you all want to check it out. And yeah, I got this for $3.93. Y'all know I cannot stop with the fixation of the color red. And y'all, it's just the thing. It's a perfect pop of color. And when I saw this in the lingerie section, I was like, we getting it. As you know, I love anything mesh, but then you add the pop of red, it's just so ideal. And the cool thing is too, is that this one has like buttons all the way down. And I've been loving seeing this kind of paired with even like the denim maxi skirt. And I have like this beautiful like red satin bra or even the bra I'm wearing underneath right now is also red. So I just feel like that in itself or with some jeans and some red flats like you know monochromatic fits baby like i think that would look so stunning and like i said i love that it has the button details because you can also open up the button so you know small opening in the front one obviously i got for me and this is expressions by california dynasty i feel like this is one of my favorite like nightgown uh brands to thrift so i definitely highly recommend you check this out because i feel like i always find great nightgown pieces by that brand and this one was a dollar and 91 cents so good so good i got you and this skirt is so freaking cute, y'all. First of all, I love the ruffle details, okay? Like, how fun is that? It is floral, but the ruffles and how it's layered, picture this with some knee-high boots, uh, some Doc Martens even. Like, print is hard to like deal with, but I thought the print was really gorgeous. And actually, this is not an item I'm gonna keep, but so stinking cute, y'all. So. This is by the brand called Notions, and it's a 1X, and it was only $1.91. So. <sighs> There's no surprise that, of course, I found a slip dress. I feel like what we've been seeing a lot lately is prints, like stripes or polka dots. I feel like polka dots are having a resurgence. I'm not saying they left, but I just feel like polka dots is one of those prominent prints that I've been seeing a lot lately. I also thought that this piece can be a Halloween costume. It is this polka dot lingerie. A slip dress again the color red just easy to pair with like realization par has released a lot of po like a red polka dot dress and it kind of gave me this similar vibes so I kind of was like okay that'd be perfect as well as I just thought this would be cute as a ladybug costume like <laughs> we got the polka dot dress and then I could just draw the little face and get some wings like a perfect little DIY now I feel like I've done that a lot lately with like slip dresses as well like I thrift so many different slip dresses because I feel like they're so easy to make into costumes so yeah, just a cute little polka dot red dress. And this is by the brand called Ambriella, and it's an extra large. Okay, I think we're going into the sweater category. The amount of freaking sweaters I found, kid you not, I am so shocked, y'all. And I still left a lot of things, so your girl definitely scored on the sweater. First one I'm gonna show, which 
It's so good. It is this cardigan. Look at the print of this, first of all. Wow, it is amazing. It is actually wool. Even the freaking like buttons are on these different colors. Do you see that? There, it's orange. Uh, like olive, navy, red, and then I think it's like a dark purple at the bottom. I just realized, I think it's people skiing. It's tagged a size large, and it's by this brand called Tier, true? And it was $1.91. And then again, of course, I found another red sweater. Anything that pops of red, we're, we're all vibing. But it's a little bit like oversized and it has like those kind of balloon sleeves where it cinches at the wrist and it's like a turtleneck. So imagine this like layered with like a trench coat and like a mini skirt with red tights like and maybe like little pumps or little kitten heels or even just like those motorcycle boots like do you see the vision i know you see it and it's by this brand called sanctuary it's a size extra small so i had to get it not for me but just had to get it this uh, mosquito bit the crap out of me i have like one two three four i have eight bites sorry i got distracted but like i just looked at my legs and i'm like wow i am bit all over this piece i'm like not sure if i want to keep i guess it just depends on like how it fits i think it's gonna be hard to show you like this but it is this like long cardigan it's giving like whimsy goth and of course it has like this big freaking um collar and i think it depends how you tie it because you can obviously like button it up all the way like I, and i've been seeing these just like wearing them kind of like a top and then like a mini skirt or like a denim mini skirt and some knee high boots so i just thought this was so cute and like i said giving me those whimsy goth vibe but this is by this brand called Ar arif arrive <laughs> it's a size large and it was only a dollar and 91 cents. These are the type of sweaters that I really wanted to find. I'm just not sure if it's gonna be in my size per se, but it is this one right here. It is these like zip up sweaters. Ideally, I would love like a dual zip. Like those are seriously my favorite type of sweaters. The way these sleeves are, they're kind of just like a bell sleeve. And I've been seeing these kind of sweaters a little bit more fitted, again, with like a denim maxi skirts. Can you tell that I've been really into like denim? Um, but even like denim mini skirts, I think this would look great. Color, I love how the bottom has the seam kind of undone so it rolls up and it is by calvin klein yeah this one was three dollars and 93 cents we have another sweater y'all so this one i'm debating on keeping just depending on how it fits a nice cream white sweater another uh, feature is that these have like the cuff sleeves which i feel like we've been seeing cuff pants so cuff sleeves is another thing i feel like we'll be also seeing and just a beautiful simple sweater like i said so many different ways you can layer it this with a fun printed like mini skirt or like even like a brown mini skirt okay girl so good and yeah i just had to get this one and this is by old navy which uh old navy just does basics so well this was four dollars and 94 cents next is this long gainum maxi dress i swear you're the chokehold that gainum print has on me is like up here and for some reason i have such a struggle finding it at the thrift specifically in my size like i said i found this dress um but i would love it in the red and white print very cottagecore-esque and again i can just imagine this taking your like spring or summer dresses and like bringing them into the fall and the way you can do that is obviously like first style maxi dress and then you can add like a trench coat knee-high boots a scarf so i just thought this is a beautiful piece for that and like i said not only perfect for the fall because i feel like this blue is like such a good print in the fall and something i've definitely seen styled on my printers before but just also a good piece that would like last year all year round this is by this brand called btfbm which i have no idea i think it says it's a size medium and I think it is because I really wanted to keep this one, but I just feel like it's going to be too small on me. But it's just so freaking pretty. Like I said, a beautiful gingham dress. And I think, does this have pockets? I'm not sure if it has. No, it doesn't. But still, very nice. You can wear it off the shoulder. 
such a beautiful piece and this one was three dollars and 93 cents this next piece ah, i'm so happy i found it this is exactly what i've been wanting and y'all i am in a cardigan phase specifically the silhouette of cardigans and it is this one right here I feel like I slept on cardigans. I think I used to get a lot of cardigans back in like 2019 But the thing is I would get the ones that were like too colorful for me And I just didn't know how to style it and now I just feel like I've been seeing cardigan styled so easy so basic So me this is just a great other piece that I know that especially when I go out and about like for example Walking my dogs and I need something quick not something really heavy like this is such an easy piece to put on And I've seen so many ways you can style a cardigan as well as layer a cardigan so I just I'm so happy I obviously have a white one a red one and I've been wearing them a lot and now I got a black one so I'm just so happy about it and this is by this brand called Caroline Taylor it doesn't say a size at all but I want to see it's like a large extra large still so good and it was only a dollar and 91 cent yes I don't know who's donating at the thrift store but they are always rotating their inventory and I feel like I always find good stuff there. Like, okay, so this next piece is so fun. It is this embroidered London oversized sweater and I had to get it. Like when I see something and it reminds me of a friend, it's something like an over a sweater. I just feel like I had to get it. I said, I can imagine Carrie wearing this. She's such a big London girl and I love, I know she likes oversized like sweaters like this. So I just, I just had to and it's just so nice and especially the embroidery on this it's so good I'm not sure I feel like this one was made because this is says by it's called by this brand called Ungeek so happy and I'll probably be giving that to her pretty soon okay so this next piece I am obsessed with it and I am just so bummed that it's probably not gonna fit me good it is this collared sweater look at first of all look at the color of this it is this beautiful like beigey taupe color this is a top you would probably see like at aritzia or something like that but the quality on this is top notch it's actually uh 75 merino wool and 25 percent angoria and it's a size medium but wow just stunning it's actually by express again the sleeves are kind of like bell sleeved just so stunning but couldn't leave it behind it was three dollars and 93 cents next thing i found is this vintage guest like midi skirt i've really been loving all different like lengths of skirts i used to be like no mini or maxi but now i'm like okay i think i could do midi as well and i think it's because the way i've been seeing it a lot styled by like sandy liang she's been doing a lot of like midi skirts and and then on my Pinterest board, I started seeing a lot of them. And I just think it's also cute when you're wearing like a mini skirt and then the boots barely like hit the end of the skirt. So I just love that as well. And it's just giving me very fall. So when I picked this up, I just pictured that. It is so nice. Check that out. Another th cool thing that's giving me very Y2K is these belt loops. And this is a size 27. It's just really really nice and this one was only a dollar ninety one cents So here's the next piece and it is just this like burgundy Red long sleeve like turtleneck. I want to say and one of the things that I saw on my Pinterest board and Constantly looking for sweaters and this one just seems so perfect y'all just wearing it in multiple ways and just styling it with a mini skirt I have been pinning so many different like red tights. I think I'm gonna be um, getting some soon um, If y'all have any place that you suggest I can get red tights. Let me know what you think some plus-size red tights Let's go now and this is by the brand called Hillard and Hansen size extra large and this one was only a dollar and 91 cents Okay, so I think now I'm going into everything. That's all accessories starting off with these long freaking leg warmers as i was saying before i went to the thrift i was like on my pinterest pinning stuff and i really liked how this person had this outfit where it was like an, like a sweater a mini skirt and then they're wearing mary jane's and like knee high socks like this but like all the way to the knee and i was like oh that'd be so fun if i can find something similar like that but i was like there's no way i'd find that like at the thrift right like what are you saying karina i literally found it at the thrift i feel like the thrift gods just are like there for me they really truly are like girl we got you and i'm just like 
Like, I don't, I'm so speechless. I cannot wait to see how I style these because like I said, this is like one of those things that is completely out of my comfort zone. I really enjoy how that person styled it, but I didn't ever like have that in mind. So we're gonna give it a go. These were only a dollar in anyone. So we've been talking about pops of color a lot. I just feel like that's a big like fall fashion trend that we've been seeing. And something that I believe Lainey Ozark was one of the first to mention is a fun like socks. And I as well has been having fun playing with my socks. And so when I saw these, I was just like, I think these would be cute with like your tennis shoes or even with like Mary Janes, which you know, girls been obsessed with those. And first of all, I found these fun like, silver metallic like glittery knee-high socks and, and they had like three different pairs of these so i obviously just got one but you can always find cool socks at the thrift and i feel like we forget some stuff like that like we forget to look at the accessories i'm so used to probably looking at accessories such as like jewelry or bags or shoes but like socks too okay you'd be surprised a lot of new socks are usually donated you can do a close-up so you could see the glitter on that. And then I got these ones. Okay, obviously the color, burgundy, anything red, but also the the style of it. I, I like the stripes on it. Guys, these feel so soft. So I was like, these are gonna be really good socks. But yeah, it's just fun, funky socks. Kind of give me like rugby or like football for some reason, but I, and these were a dollar and 91 cents. Another fun thing that I found, which these I'm not sure if they're gonna fit, but your girl's gonna try are these like teal pantyhose or tights. Like, again, another thing that I've been pinning on my Pinterest is like tights with a simple outfit. I already mentioned it to y'all, but these are in a teal color, like so good. And this was only a dollar and 21 cents. Talking about accessories, I got this scarf and it's just a simple plaid scarf, but I also pictured this y'all, I know as making it into a tube top, okay? I've been obsessed with plaid and I just feel like I've been struggling to find like a plaid top or anything like that. And I was like, you know, you can do that with the scarf. So I thought that as well would be cool to do. And then of course you can wear it as a scarf. Definitely giving me like Burberry vibes, but obviously not Burberry, but like this just adds so much to an outfit. Like that is what fall is superior because you have all these fun like different ways of layering and accessorizing like okay this one was a dollar and 91 cents and of course after the 30 percent off it was just way more affordable ah everything's falling okay last thing i have is shoes y'all i've been talking for almost an hour i've been speeding through a lot of these so i'm just like shocked at everything i found it's like one of my biggest hauls <laughs> we were talking about mary janes and kid you not i saw these and i cannot leave them behind they are these black mary janes in this like velvet texture only thing is that these are a size 39 and i am a 40 or 41 i believe a 39 is like a, a nine or eight and a half i'm not sure but they're just so stinking cute very classic they look like they were new and they were just like chilling in someone's closet i was so happy when i saw this and i was so bummed when i found out that they're not my size we can fit one of you if you want to <laughs> we'll see in the future wait wait i did end up seeing these yellow ones and yes these are super bright but again with the concept of the pop of color and then i did see this girl on TikTok that I recently started following. She was talking about how you can take your like basic outfits and make them a little bit more elevated. You can go like a very neutral outfit and then you just add a pop of something. And I feel like that's what I usually try to do is like I love my neutrals, I love my basic outfits, but then have like something that's a statement and that is this. Like this would be such a beautiful like statement shoe even with like a white top and a denim jean and then you add this like this will make the outfit different like fun and so that's kind of why i got these like bright yellow mary jeans and honestly y'all if it's something that i'm a sucker for it is freaking shoes like i have a hard time saying no to shoes and then the last thing i have are these boots first of all i am a little nervous that these are not gonna fit because your girl got wide calf like I don't even want to measure it, but I know I got a wife cap. And I do see that these have like some ties on the side. 
So I'm hoping I can make them a little bit looser. These are shoes that I dream of like thrifting, but never like find them. What are the freaking odds? It's just, I had to get these. That was everything that I ended up thrifting. Like I literally feel like I thrifted one of the top like fall like thrift with me's that I've done in like a long time. Like for me, I'm like, girl, you, you hit the fall vibes for sure. This has been, I feel like, a very long thrift for me. <laughs> so I'm gonna end the video here. That is all for today's video. I really, truly hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to give it a like. And if you're new, hit the subscribe button down below. It would mean so much to me. I truly want to reach 100K and do like a massive giveaway. So please, please help your girl out and make that happen. <laughs> I would truly, truly appreciate it. Um, if you also want to catch up with me, you can follow me on all my socials. I'm living as Karina on IG, TikTok, whatnot. Love you lots, and I'll see you soon with a new video. Bye.